Hi, this is Dr. Gary. Welcome to the Daily Tune-Up today. Man, thank you for the feedback yesterday on the random act of kindness. Many of you emailed me and said it was really fun and you never looked at it the way we were talking about. Like, it's really a gift to you. Nothing is better than giving to someone else. In fact, when you give something to someone else, that's one of the greatest joys in life because what it's really kind of self-gratifying because what we're really getting from it is the smile coming back to us and it's kind of nice to receive that. So keep it up. It can't hurt, correct? Now today, let's talk about what's really, really important in each one of our lives each day. And I touched on it just a little bit talking about kids the other day and young people and what they really want. It's really true with all of us. I know as I move through my life, one of the things I really want more than anything is just to be accepted. And when you're a character like me sometimes, it's sometimes difficult because I'm in the business of challenging people, sometimes upsetting people, sometimes making people mad in order to get them to grow through the cathartic events that create growth and enlightenment on the other end. When you're a facilitator for that, and many of you are the same thing for your kids, for people in your family, sometimes it feels like you're the bearer of bad news. Always remember, Einstein had a great quote, and I love this. He said, hard is good, easy is bad. And a lot of people have been brought up to believe hard is bad and easy is good. And they accept easy as a good thing, and they seek easiness. And even a lot of times in my tune-ups, I say, let's let things go, let's allow, let's get rid of the stress. That is not getting rid of hard and making things easy. What it's learning to do is accept hard. What it's learning to do is accept growth. What it's learning to do when you allow is letting the growth absorb inside of you rather than fighting it. When we fight growth, what really happens is we really stay the same. And if we stay the same and not grow, it means we are really limiting the ability we have to fulfill not only our true purpose in life, but to have a positive effect on other people. Today, what I want you to do, I want you to really, really take a look at what we did yesterday with random acts of kindness and then think about your capability to mentor another person. Now, you might not be a rocket scientist, a medical doctor, or a lawyer. I'm talking about mentoring people at a soulful level, at a level deep down inside their spirit. When you're not telling them exactly what they want to hear, you're asking them to reflect on what they're learning and be a facilitator to move them through that. If you'll do that, it's also a form of another gift you can give to someone. Many times when we hear someone helping us and facilitating us, it's just easier to see the light. So today, let's work on that. Now until tomorrow, I'm wishing you a pleasant day. And oh, by the way, just a surprise for you. I have a surprise for you. It's coming up shortly. We're going to be making an announcement right here on the tune-ups. And that's the only place you're going to get it. Not on the website. It's going to be right here. And it's going to affect all of you. And you're going to have an opportunity with me. So let's keep watching. And we're going to be announcing that the first of next week right here on the tune-ups. And I want you to participate. So until then, this is Dr. Gary. I will see you tomorrow. You have a great day. And remember, facilitate. Bye-bye.